Oh my God. So you're asking me home on Christmas fucking Eve because you're sick. There's been cut down in the medical area all through the year. So of course they sent me. What's the problem? Are you dying? I guess you're not dying because you look pretty healthy to me. Stomach ache. Jeez. Can we get some light in here? Stomach ache. It is Christmas. Haven't you just been eating too much? And a fever. Okay, let me check. Yeah, you actually do have a fever. Hmm. Well, you know what I did for you? I took my motorcycle, I'm drunk, and I ride it. I drove in traffic just to get to you and your stomach. So I'm really hoping that you really have some problem with your stomach and you don't I just have to go take a dump, okay? But you do have a fever, so... Okay. Will you please take a big, deep breath for Uncle Bad? Hold it in. Keep holding it in. You ain't gonna die. And breathe out. Okay. And once again, breathe in. And breathe out. I'm going to listen to your lungs too. Okay. Yeah, it's a bit cold. I'm sorry I didn't have to... I didn't know I had to warm it before I came here. Okay. Deep breath in. Hold it. And out. And in. And out. Okay. Well, you kind of, you kind of have kind of like an infection, I think. It is Christmas. I'm allowed to drink beer on Christmas. What do you mean I'm not a serious doctor? Of course I'm a serious doctor. <gasps> oh my god, I know exactly what's wrong with you. Yeah, I do, I do, I do. Now, don't panic, don't panic for God's sake. You have a really bad disease. Yeah, don't move or you could die. Actually, you could die right now. I'm going to put this one on you. Okay. Hold your head still, will ya? Okay. There we go. And now, for God's sake, don't say anything. No, no, no. Be quiet. Be quiet. This is a serious illness. Yeah. So I don't want you to say anything. Just lay there. Uh, think that you are just two eyeballs. Two eyeballs floating in space. Yeah. You must not mus move a muscle, okay? Cool. Is this your ashtray, by the way? Don't say anything. All right. Okay, I will listen to your heart once again. Don't say anything. 
anything. That's why I put the mask on you, because you really need it right now. This is a dangerous disease. This is a dangerous disease. And one fragment of muscle movement in your mouth could actually kill you, okay? Nasty disease, nasty disease. Oh, yeah. What? Don't say anything, I told you. I need to take a couple of sips of beer and think through how we're going to move you to the hospital without killing you. I guess you would want the beer right now, wouldn't you? Yeah, Christmas beer and everything. Unfortunately, you can't have any. You're about to die. <sighs> it's a nice house you have here, by the way. Don't answer. You're supposed to be quiet. Oh, wait. What's this? I think I found something over. I don't want you to talk, I just want you to uh, be without the mask. Yeah, you can talk, I feel kind of lonely sitting here. Christmas Eve and everything. So what did I think happen? I think you drank too many beers and you got a belly ache. And since you drank beers, you got paranoid and uh, you call me without reason, which makes me pretty pissed off, yeah, because I was just about to have some Christmas turkey at home and the phone rang and I had to go out to you just because you had a stomach ache. So, since you're so very ill, I better pump your stomach, shouldn't I? Yeah. Open your mouth and I will put this in. Okay. Open wine. <laughs> yes, it's supposed to feel that way. That's the way you get for being in pain in the ass. I'm just going to pump up everything you have been eating here during Christmas. <laughs> no, I'm not. Listen here, I think you had a bad shrimp or something like that. I'm sorry it hurt with the holes in your throat. What am I supposed to do? Cry me a river, will you? Let me tell you one. I didn't want this job. You know who I am? I'm Dr. Bad. Yeah, I know it sounds, well, bad, but that's the name I've been given, and I'm not going to change it because it's a family history. I am a doctor who discovers uncurable diseases, and I fix them. I, you know, 
I'm not going to drive around fixing people who has ate the shrimp too much. It's just because there's cut down on the hospital. And because I touched the boss's ass. Well, I'm going to leave you here now. You are going to be fine. Just take it easy, will you? Nothing. So have a happy Christmas, Hanukkah, what the fuck ever you calling it. Because I am going to have it. Because I can eat food. But you shouldn't really eat anything right now. Just lie there. I will give, uh, I will uh, leave a puke bucket with you. Yeah. Have a nice day. And remember, everybody lies.